I actually just did a vlog and um, it's all failed. Well, obviously not in a failure uh, kind of sense. It's because honestly I couldn't upload it because it was. I sort of agreed to myself that it was quite sec uh, secretive, really. Quite secret, uh, secretive indeed, obviously, because it was um, a clod up a dig. A uh, clod up a um, multi acting club, obviously. Uh, dig, if you like. On the 7th of December, uh, it is, obviously. And uh, secretively, I couldn't exactly tell the location that I knew, uh, purposely because, uh, well, I found a rumour that someone obviously knew where it was. And uh, I sort of did a vlog which told everything about it, so obviously, I I'm actually going to upload that on the twenty seventh, uh, sorry, the eighth of um, December. Obviously, after the Clodopper, uh, and um, Mel Detecting Club did recently. <laughs> Just after, yeah, obviously the dig, um, because before the dig, it would obviously give a lot of it away, and you know those people called night talkers who don't gain permission or any act under the Treasure Act of nineteen ninety six. They don't agree by any of that or abide by any of it, and so. They just go on archaeological sites and dig it up and find the artifacts that are yet to be discovered. That were obviously yet to be discovered by archaeologists and professional um, licensed detectorists, like myself, obviously, and my dad. So uh, obviously about that, and uh, yes, uh, it's quite secretive, but I can tell you it's extremely, extremely historical. I'm afraid there's going to be. I can't exactly say what there is, but a lot. So, I bet you're looking forward to that, truly. Very much so. And uh, also, I just went on a clodop dig on the 23rd of obviously November at um, in Gloucester. Uh, Gloucester, if you like. Uh, I believe it was in, yeah. Uh, where was it? Um... Mitchell Dean, yep, in Gloucester. Ah, uh, very fine. I found a um a Georgian, possibly even Guillermo, which is obviously uh, William the Third, Silver Spoon. Uh, well, it was quite a fair find. Uh, obviously, uh, the mint mark or the initial mark on it was M S. If anyone can identify that, obviously put it in the comment section below. But if not, then just leave it blank. Uh, it was it was actually a fairly good find. Uh, my dad actually at the same time found a um. George the second Hoffmanny dated seventeen forty seven in fairly nice condition, seeing as though it's a grotty cup coin. Well usually they are. Uh I mean, yeah, and uh few fair people found coins, Victorian half pennies, so I'm very unfortunate on them because I love Victorian half pennies and that and pennies but I just never find them. It's usually got a couple of, couple of Georgians for me, but hey ho. Uh, also, on the 16th of November, I went to Chasley Corbett on another Clot of a Mail Detecting Club dig. That's the only uh, club that I actually am um, in association with. Also, the Midlands Mail Detecting Club, additionally. Uh, I found. Uh, actually, there's one hammered on this field, which was absolutely isolated with no finds whatsoever. And on the. Well, the information came, it was actually. Uh, race course, obviously. Um, yeah, race course. Can you believe that? The pull tabs galore. Uh, almost a galore to you, pull tabs. A few coins. My dad found a pound coin, and that was it, because he's any old tornado, and my obviously old Gavitis 50 wasn't working correctly, and so he found nothing whatsoever. I found a couple of 5Bs at a great depth with my new XP Gomex Bow, obviously, if you've seen the videos, uh, the obviously down in the channel. So my earlier videos on that. Good, really. But now I'm sure they're going to improve, obviously. Uh, on the 7th of December, though, obviously, it's going to be a brilliant dig, and I'll see you then, fortunately. But um, if not, it's obviously going to be quite an adequate dig. As I say, Charles Lecourt was probably extre an extremely bad dig, honestly. <sighs> Some people uh, stayed there determined for approximately a good seven hours until dusk. Uh, no one found anything. I believe there was a gold ring on the race course, obviously, because there's always a gold ring on the Clodop Dig. Well, when it's a race course. But there's always a hammer on the Clodop Dig. There never has been not a hammered found. And it's just unreasonable, truly. You think these hammered coins are so scarce, you barely ever find them. But there's one found on every Clodop Dig so far that I've been to from the 31st of August, the first one I ever went to. Quite embarrassed I was then, obviously, but no, it's alright. 
I've enjoyed Clodopus. If anyone would like to go, the link will be in the description. Uh, the video that corrupted, obviously, I'm going to delete that. But, um, yeah, actually, on the uh, Gloucester Dig 23rd, it's actually 23rd today, uh, I found a s yeah, silver spoon. Um, my dad found, obviously, that cup of George in 1747, George II. Uh, I also found a spindle wall, and my dad found a fragment of a ball and another part fragment of a curl bell. Very nearby I found that. Uh, I don't know where that the other half uh the other fragment's gone but hey ho. I'll find another in the future, possibly even intact. And quite a few buttons as well. But guys we had a fairly nice day. Uh but apart from that, I'll see you in a bit and another vlog. Because vlogging's going to become a vital part of my channel now. But uh anyway, in a bit. See ya. Next vlog in well Couple of minutes, maybe. Hey, hey. Let's uh, see you in a bit. So, guys, as I said uh, early in the video, uh, obviously I'm compiling the video on my iMovie, and I iMovie on my iPhone now, obviously, as I would need to c compile the video. As I said early in the video, uh, I was going to upload it on the eighth, I believe I said. I'm afraid I can't exactly do that now, um, reasonably because, well. Obviously, it gives most of the information that I gave away in this video, and secondly, because uh, it's pointless after the um, dig has already been, obviously, over with, uh, and its secretive location as well. But uh, on the 8th, I'd actually, instead of that, be uploading a approximately 10 minute video, because that's my limitation to my phone's um, uh, storage, obviously, for the uh, recording. And. Uh, yeah, it'll be fairly fun. Uh, I'll, hopefully, it's going to be a fairly good dig. Uh, well, I think it will be, maybe. Yeah. Uh, and it's going to be a good, um, a few fair live digs that I probably haven't done before in compilation because I've now got iMovie, of course. And uh, I'll be making some very good digs, trust me. And uh, when I do so, I'll be making some continuous ones. And uh, hopefully, you'll be pleased by that. Now, recently, actually, I've actually. Um, just asked a really hunting Scotland, 8,552 subscribers, I believe. That knowledge, though, uh, yeah. Uh, momentarily, of course, uh, 25th December 2014. Obviously, 25th of... That's Christmas. 25th... <laughs> 25th November 2014, sorry. Yeah, it seems like uh, I'm on drugs, but I'm not. But um, I've asked him for a shout-out. When I do, obviously, guys, you'll be watching this. 300 people will be watching this, hopefully. If they're not, then I'm sorry. But, guys, uh, sorry to disturb you. Just need to tell you that additional information. And uh, in a bit. 